If you love Baltimore sports, you'll love WNST.net. BaltimoreSportsReport.com here at the First Mariner Arena with a man who really needs no introduction to Baltimore sports uh, business. Well, That's right, Mauricio. Yeah. How you right. doing, man? Good to see you. Good, good. Uh, thanks for joining me today. Cool, no problem. So I just wanted to ask you a couple questions, man. It's a home over this year in 2010 season. What are your thoughts about indoor football in Baltimore? Well, I've never really been to a game. I mean, it hasn't been promoted all that well. I think this might be one of the best crowds I've ever had. Yeah. It's like about 2,500 people. Um, I think it's a good start. I've seen a lot of Raven fans here, a lot of families, mixed age group, and it, I don't know, it's, it's a great way to spend a Sunday. Uh, we're having a great time. We can't stop smiling. It's fun. It is fun. Uh, how about the AIFA rules? I mean, for instance, if uh, if the kicker's kicking off, they can do the goal post, it's one point. What it's do you some think? sort of weird, like, Canadian football rouge sort of thing, uh, but it makes every play a lot more fun. They throw the ball a lot, they're tackling. The fact that you can catch the ball off the walls, it's a little weird. You know, you have to look at it a little bit try to figure it out. But I think it is fun coming to a game and having to try to figure out what's going on. Right. Well, I saw your uh, WNST out there. I guess not the 50-yard line, but what, about, about the 20? 20, 22 and a half. Close to, close to midfield. So uh, you're pretty involved in the team here. They've been very involved with us. I mean, they, they came after us and said, that, you know, NST was the way they wanted to go as a media partner. We're flattered by that. And I really didn't know what to make of it. I mean, there have been some bad teams here before. And, you know, we only want to associate with something that's going to work as well. This has been a great day. It's been a lot of fun. they got good sponsors. they got kids out here playing. We're at halftime right now. Kids out here from Hereford are playing ball. Uh, so I think they're doing a lot of stuff right. So I want to ask you about the other two teams in Baltimore. Uh, the Ravens just revamped their receiving court uh, with Anquan Bolden. How do you feel about this season? Well, I don't think they're done. I mean, we're not even up on the draft. I mean, so far, so good. I mean, but it's still an incomplete report card no matter what they do. Right. Let's just try to get to the beginning of the season. But clearly they help the pass it. And that's right. all you can want in the offseason is to hope that they're getting back. Well, April's right around the corner. What are your thoughts on the Orioles for this year? Oh, boy. <laughs> you know, hope for the best. I mean, what else are you going to do? It's been 13 years. How old are you? I'm 22. Looks like he's about 14. That's all right, man. I thought, I thought you'd never... So you were nine the last time you won. It's been a while. Yeah. Uh, what do you, you know, we're all hoping. Wishing and hoping. That's all. Well, Nestor, what's going on at WNST? Web-based, and um, you know we're about to come out with a daily product every day. We're doing uh, chat rooms and Oreo games this year. We're doing another King of Baltimore Sports for a youngster like yourself to come over and do this sort of thing and uh, having fun. Yeah, cool. check us out, man. We're launching a mobile site next month too. Very Always cool. developing stuff at NST. Very cool. Well, Nestor Aparicio at WNST. I'm Zach Wolf from BaltimoreSportsReport.com. Thanks a lot for joining us. Nice to meet you, Zach. Nice to meet you. If you love Baltimore sports, you'll love WNST.net.